Hey YouTube, hope you're doing well. Welcome back to the channel. And in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to finish your long shot camos super easy, super fast, literally in two games. Currently, I've been using the soul rifles to get diamond camo, but this video will also help you getting long shots for submachine guns, tactical rifles, like machine guns, sniper rifles. But first off, guys, if you find yourself enjoying this video or the video helped you at all, please do me a huge favor, drop a like on today's video and subscribe for more future Call of Duty content. All right, let's go. First off, in order to start completing your long shot camos, you have to rank up your weapon to level 20. You cannot go for long shot camos if you don't have the geometric camos unlocked, but I'm assuming you're ready to go because you're watching this video. Now let's get on with the class setup. I'm going to be using the gunfire wild card because the more attachments, the better. The first three attachments I'm about to say, I highly recommend slapping them on on any weapon you're using. It's a must. For the optic, I highly recommend using the axial arms 3x scope. I find myself comfortable using the optic and getting long shots with this optic is so easy. If you don't have this unlocked, uh, use the vision tech two times, it'll work just fine. Use the suppressor so that enemies can't hear where your shots are coming from. And probably the most important attachment in the game is the flashlight or the spotlight. Uh, with this, enemies will have a red circle on top of them so you can easily spot them. It's like having Markspan from Modern Warfare 3. It's just easier to point out enemies. Uh, in this gameplay with the AK-47, I was using the Tiger Team Spotlight. And that's because I was using the Blueprint, which comes with the AK-47. For the barrel, it doesn't really matter. Use anything that has high bullet velocity so that your bullets come out faster. Also, at this point of your weapon progression, the good attachments are still locked. So for right now, the other attachments are not that important. Uh, you can use whatever you want, maybe put on a 40 round mag for more bullet capacity. For the perks, use Tactical Mask, Scavenger, and Ghost. Now it's no surprise, but the fastest way to get long shots, it's by playing Hardcore. Hardcore TDM is decent, but the game ends too fast. Domination is a good option as well, but I find myself running into tryhard parties and it's more sweatier there. The, the good thing, Domination takes more time to end, so basically, you can stack up a, like, a lot of long shot medals. But the whole going try hard isn't really appealing to me, but when it comes to Kill Confirm, it's a sweet balance of TDM and Domination, and I find myself getting plenty of long shots while, while I'm playing Kill Confirm. The beauty about playing Hardcore is that it literally takes one bullet to kill a target, and when you slap on a suppressor, it's like they don't know where these shots are coming from, especially when there's no kill camps to watch after dying. I highly recommend playing big maps like Satellite, which is a favorite of mine to get long shots, and Miami. Now another map you can get long shots is the map Crossroads, where on screen this is the side of the map where you can get most of the long shots, but this side of the map is not really a hot spot, but it's still a possibility to get long shots here in the map Crossroads. All the other maps have long shot locations, but they're more specific for specific scenarios, but I highly recommend playing on these maps that I mentioned earlier, and maybe give Crossroads a try. Now, I don't know if you guys missed it earlier on the video, but I showed you guys how many long shots I got in two games, but the first set of long shots that I earned was in the map Crossroads, and I got a total of 15 long shots. To me, this was a tester map I was testing the map out for long shots and to my surprise I came out the match with 15 long shots which is really good but we could do better on other maps like satellite or Miami now in the following game we played the map satellite and I earned a total of 29 long shots which is really I mean really good uh, if you do the maths of like the first match on crossroads and the map here on satellite that's a total of 44 long shots that means I'm still missing like six long shots in order to complete this set of camos. The point that I'm trying to get across is that play hardcore to get these long shots, my dudes. The faster you finish these camos, the faster you will unlock gold. In no time, your road to diamond or dark matter will be a breeze. But with that said, that's going to be it for today's video, man. I'm going to let this satellite gameplay play out for you guys to kind of take notes and maybe copy my playing style here on satellite. Hope this video was helpful to everyone. And let me know in the comments what do you guys think about this video. Make sure to drop a like and subscribe. You guys have been around here. And I'll talk to you guys later in the next video. But remember, stay rad.